Hey, it's James Young, official mayor of Cowboy Country. I'm going to do a short video here. Uh, I want to put some statistics up right here. This basically shows you how many points teams have scored after three games. Uh, these are everybody that's in the Big 12 Conference. Um, I know TCU is not undefeated, but they're the only ones that has actually won a conference game so far. So they're 2-1 and one overall, but they're 1-0 and oh in conference. Now, if you look at all of the teams, the left column is how many points they've scored, and the right column is how many points they've allowed. Now, here's the good news for Oklahoma State fans. The average is 56.43 points allowed. So Oklahoma State's only allowed 61 points. And 31 of them were against South Alabama, I think. Problem is, if you look at all the different teams in the Big 12, there's only one that has scored less points than Oklahoma State. One. And that's Iowa State. And their, their quarterback, Hunter Deckers, may not get to play this year. If they if the NCAA suspends him for the entire year for gambling. So 61 points is not enough. You know, if we had lost that game against South Alabama, if it had been like 35 to 31 I don't think there would have been nearly the amount of outcry and just outrage that has existed. Now, Mike Gundy can talk all he wants about not wanting to listen to the skeptics and critics on the internet, but the fact that our offense has only scored... Uh, a little over 20 points a game when we are so used to such prolific offenses, offenses. We've had great quarterbacks like Brandon Whedon and Zach Robinson and Clint Shelf and even Spencer Sanders, who I was a, a critic of, big time critic. And quite frankly, I take him back in a heartbeat. But whether you go with Gunnar Gundy or you go with Rangel, pick somebody. Run the ball, play action pass. If we can win 10 games with Clint Shelf as a starting quarterback, we should be able to run the football, play action pass, I mean, how do you have Ollie Gordon only have three carries? You know why? Because we started off slinging the ball with Bowman. We didn't run at all, and our defense got stuck back out there again and again and again and again, and eventually they got tired. I don't know if Mike Gundy's going to see this or not, but obviously we need to make some changes. Thankfully, and I want to end on a good note, they did make some changes on the offensive line, and things got better, and we started moving the ball consistently. That was really good. So if we need to make more changes to the offensive line, do it. If you need to start throwing it more to the tight ends, do it. Um... I played wide receiver in high school. There's no excuse for all the drops. None. If the ball hits your hand, you need to catch it. That's the way I was taught when I played high school uh, football. I graduated in 1991. I know that might be considered old school, but if the ball hits your hands and you're a wide receiver, you need to catch the ball. So, anyway, that was, that's my feelings about this whole situation. 
I do think that Oklahoma State will rebound, and I do think they'll beat Iowa State. Because without Hunter Deckers, I don't see Iowa State winning. I don't think they're going to win another game this year. I hope Hunter Deckers gets a second chance. Everybody deserves a second chance. The kid made a mistake. I hope that, I hope they give him a second chance. Suspend him for six games. Uh, include the three games he's already sat out. And um, anyway, that's all I got to say about that. If you are new to the channel, please hit like and subscribe. I uh, do appreciate everybody who watches. Uh, I'm not sure what we're going to do for the rest of the year as far as trying to see other stadiums are concerned. I uh, do know uh, we are going to go to homecoming in October, and our goal is to go to the UCF game in Orlando in November. So we might be able to, to get a different stadium in Florida when we make that trip. So... But until then, I hope you have a great day, and as always, go Pokes. Bye.